If you're a fan of anime at all, you've most definitely heard this question at least once in your life. Can they beat Goku though? Even I myself have been tormented by this question for years and now I finally decided to seek out the answers I've been looking for. And while I might not be a scientist, I definitely am a big loser. So I've downloaded an anime game with a huge ginormous roster of over 200 plus anime characters in order to answer the simple question of who can actually beat Goku. So let's kick it off by going into watch mode now. Of course, I'm doing this with no way I can intervene. So it will just be Goku up against whoever he wants to go against here. Now, of course, for most of these, I'll just be letting him pick randomly, but I wanted to start it off with Goku versus Ippo. If you haven't seen or read any of Ippo, I definitely recommend it. It's the story of a young man that wants to become strong through his passion and hobby of boxing. And through that journey, obviously, he learns a lot about himself and, of course, other people around him and what it truly means to be strong. And oh my God, Goku's already going in for the kill. He is leaving nothing here of remorse. Ippo has no chance. He lands a few counter blows, but nothing else is going to stop Goku. He's got him in the corner by god epo he doesn't know what it's like to be strong key blast attacks he's charging up for the kill epo's bracing for impact but is this really the best strategy my god goku's go oh epo with the deadly dem zero counter he's going for it all here folks he's got him where he, where he wants him a huge counter blow knocks goku away but he can't land the follow-up combo he needs to kill goku with multi-hitting punch misses a combo misses it again and an instant transmission behind him. He knows deadly cross-ups. Ippo has a great chance here with that Dempsey roll combo that shocked the stands. I myself have goosebumps. And an amazing uppercut counter blow. He's once again bracing and bringing back. Goku teleports in close, but Ippo, he's going crazy. Oh my God, Goku just doesn't care. He doesn't care what it's like to be strong. He doesn't care that he used to own a fish. Oh, D-Blast attack. My God, Goku's charging up. What could he be going for? It's another combo attack. Jesus Christ, Ippo's bare on his last leg. But an amazing behind the back kidney blow. Oh, that meant nothing in the face of a key blast though. Goku wins against Ippo. Ippo cannot beat Goku. That, that is just science. All right, like I said, we're going to be doing random from here on out. So up next, who will be taking on Goku? Who the fuck is Adam? Can Adam beat Goku? This man is barely covering his dick up. I don't know how he stands a chance against Goku. Will Goku take the lead? By God, he went right for the dick and opening and Goku just took it. Key blast attack. Adam, do something. Oh my god. He stands no chance. This is huge. The key blast attack is so cheap. Oh, what an uppercut from Adam. My god, it doesn't matter though. Goku is just not giving him a break. The key charging is happening again. Adam's also key charging. I guess that's a thing he can do. The spirit bomb. By god, he lands the spirit bomb. And he doesn't not gonna give him a chance to break. Whoa, whoa! Oh my god, Adam launching a flurry of attacks! Oh, what a huge landing against Goku. It does nothing. It does next to nothing against Goku's impenetrable health bar. Adam with a huge cutscene attack. Goku does not care, though. Oh, but Adam's still fighting back. A flurry of attacks. This one's for E, folks. Goku needs to get up and fight back. This could be per this could be somebody that could stand a chance. An amazing 19-hit combo. 22 hits. 23. Insane. Oh, my God. Another follow-up. Goku's on his last legs here. Oh, a multi-hitting slash, and it might just be Goku, a Kamehameha wave. And that's going to be it for Adam. Adam put up a hell of a fight, though. That was insane. Well, after an amazing two battles from Adam and Ippo, we don't really know who's going to be random. Now, Kid Buu, this one's just canon. We already know the answer to this one. No way Kid Buu wins this. Goku won in the show. Kid Buu did put up a really good fight and possibly could have won if it wasn't for the intervention of Vegeta and everybody on the Earth. So let's see what happens here. Bro is, bro is just saying things. What is he barking about? All right, here we go. Round one between Goku and Kid Buu. Or should we say round two? Oh, Kid Buu with an impressive display of skill. It does not matter, though. Goku charging up. He doesn't have the time. Finally, we have another warrior with Key Blast. Goku's been spamming these all day to make the most out of them. Oh, Kid Buu screaming. Goku's just going to let him do it, too. Oh, my God. Key Blast attacks. Kid Buu actually has the health lead. Kid Buu actually has an insane health lead, an amazing anti-air. But finally, Goku's got a bit of a combo here going. Some teleports. Key Blast Cannon. Oh, they're both charging up. Goku's going to hit level three first. And he's using a, a melee counter. Me not melee counter, melee super. Beautiful pickup. He's got Kid Buu right where he wants him. Oh, an insane Kamehameha off from Buu. And he's back, back to charging up. Did he just throw his arms and fold him from across the room into a scream? What a combo. I just realized these guys are fighting an Imetsu no Yaiba. Instant transmission. He's using it to start a combo. Beautiful move. Kid Buu did not see that one coming. Doesn't matter. Kid Buu sees him now. Oh. Oh, what a match. 
Oh, oh, Goku knocks out Kid Buu. This time he didn't even put up a fight. Didn't even need the people of the earth or the spirit bomb. He needed the spirit bomb to beat Adam. Kid Buu put up a good fight. Uh, not the best fight so far though. Adam definitely takes number one. And now Goku's going up against... Who is this? Who is Fusuke? Who is this random child that just walked in? Who is this sassy child? My God, he's fast. What? His speed doesn't really matter though. Goku's just bullying this guy. Bro just punched a tornado into existence? The spirit bomb on Fusuke? Oh my God, he busts out the spirit bomb into a key blast cannon. Who is this random kid that needs all this? Here he goes with another spear, two spirit bombs for the price of one. And that's gonna be it. The three spirit bombs. He did a spirit bomb just to flex. He didn't even throw it at the guy. He just missed, bounce it back, go on. Goku, very happy he beat up a grade school student. Well, we'll see if Goku keeps that same energy up against his next opponent, Metal Bat. Oh, from One Punch Man? Oh, this is like one of my favorite characters out of One Punch Man too. But if there's one thing we know for sure, it's that Metal Bat is no Saitama. He is not Saitama. So he's going to need a miracle to beat Goku here. And they're off. Metal Bat standing a pretty good chance. He's absolutely letting him have it, though. He's just swinging for the fences. But he's going to need a Grand Slam and then Sun if he's going to take out Sun Goku. He's leaving holes in the ground with just a Metal Bat. Damn! What a combo. Three hits, but it's powerful. My God, Metal Bat actually has a bit of a lead here. Oh, a flurry of attacks, but it all misses. Goku must have been moving too fast to be seen. Goku's just doing kickflips. Is he going to swing that? Oh, I thought that was a swing attack. Metal Bat needs something here. He needs a level 3 super. He needs something. Key Blast Cannon, Goku's favorite go-to super. Metal Bat, he's moving through the air. And a counter attack. It wasn't enough to beam. And that's going to finish Metal Bat off. He never stood a chance. Metal Bat falls, but that only means he's made space for Hancock from One Piece. I don't think Goku really cares that much about women, but we'll see if Hancock stands a good chance here. I have a bad feeling that Goku is about to make this look like a Sigma male grind set edit right here. Why is Hancock just posing like that? Here's hoping she puts up a good fight. Oh, she's just posing on him. Goku's just dancing. He's turned into stone. There, my Hancock's throwing hands. Oh, what an amazing attack. Dodge Goku. Oh, he was, he was, he was tempted. He was tempted, but he didn't fall for it. He didn't fall for it. Fight back, Goku. Hancock actually putting up a, a, a bunch of damage here. Hancock kind of got movement skills. She just dashes in. She's insanely fast. No! Goku got turned to stone. But he's fighting back now. Chi-Chi about to be pissed. Spear bomb, but she doesn't get up. And responds with her own brave arrow. Goku stone. Hancock uses that time to go back and charge up even more. Goku's back to stone again. It's an infinite stone loop and Goku's not smart enough to get out of it. This could be the start of Goku's comeback though. He's gonna need a miracle. Oh my God, she got him in the loop. She has him in the loop. The spirit bomb. That's what Goku needed to land right there. That's huge damage. The only way Goku's going to get past her beam. She's definitely put up a great fight though. It's not over yet. She still has the health lead. Goku's going to level three. Braveheart does a lot. Brave Arrow, that's close. He's on his last legs. Goku's fighting back now. He needs to get more space, but he's going in for the kill. The spirit bomb could land here. He gets taken out by the brave arrow. The winner is Hancock. Hancock can actually beat Goku. We finally found one person on this roster of 200 plus that can beat Goku. Will we see another competitor like that in Toriko? Damn, bro was eating like Goku. He's trying his best, but was that a fork? I'm actually not familiar with the series he's from. He spawned in a fork. And, oh, damn, what a cop. He keep last cannon. I don't, I don't think he's going to stand a chance. Maybe I'll be wrong, though. Nope, nope, was, wasn't wrong. Well, it was not wrong on that one. But he put up a... And he had interesting combos. He, why he laid out like that? Goku versus Ichigo. Now, this could be a very interesting one. Ooh, Ichigo is fast. We're going to need to see some Bankais from Ichigo here. D damn, he is crazy fast. What are Ichigo's speed feats? There's no way he's moving like this. Bro, bro can barely see, be seen by the human eye. How did he get over there? What, what is happening? Oh my God. Ichigo, why? Whoa. What just happened? Ichigo is flexing on the competition right now. Th this character is cool. Th where'd he go? Goku barely saw him, but he saw him nonetheless. He's using the time from his projectile to charge up. And he got behind Goku in an instant. And he got behind Goku again. We may be looking at a busted character here, folks. Can Goku actually compete against this? My God. My God, this is cheap. It, oh, the beam. It doesn't matter. Ichigo got behind him within a blink of an eye. Goku still has great damage, though. The key blasts are all you really... Oh, he's behind him. Nothing personal, kid. Oh. What am I watching right now? 
Ichigo is going crazy. He froze Goku with time. He's getting infinite combos. Bro, looks like zero in MVC3. Goku is barely holding on. He needs one good combo to win, but Ichigo's not going to let him get it off. Oh, wait. Wait, Goku's fighting back now. He needs a beam attack. He, he can't charge up. Ichigo's going to take advantage of that. He's, it's done. It's done. Ichigo might just be able to beat Goku. He's done. Oh, he's still alive. He left Goku with one HP. And that's all he needs to secure the victory. Ichigo threw. By God, Ichigo just threw. That was insane. That was definitely one of the best matches so far. Goku versus Ichigo was a bona fide classic. And now we've got Goku versus Piccolo? <laughs> this is just another Dragon Ball match. They're charging in the snow. I can barely see these two characters. Very Dragon Ball beginning. They respect each other. Two long-term rivals. And Piccolo just doesn't even get... Oh, but he missed. <laughs> yeah, somehow I don't think Orange Piccolo's in the game yet, bro. Oh, special beam Ganon versus Spirit Bomb. Piccolo stood up and said enough with that. Piccolo with crazy combos. He might just be able to beat Goku. Goku using instant transmission to take advantage of the speed difference. But Piccolo is here to play. Piccolo actually has some nasty looking combos too. Oh, 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 oh. Disgusting combos. Oh, damn. God, Goku looking like a Cyberman. Except right here, Piccolo is kind of down in the snow, begging to be let up. But he actually has a very good chance. Oh, the arm grab wraps him up like a Christmas present. You're not going to see Goku under the tree this year. Goku has a long way to go if he's going to beat Piccolo, though. Oh, I don't think it's going to happen. I think Piccolo has his number now. He wasn't ready for orange boost Piccolo. Not that I think this Piccolo is tapped into that, but he's just naturally gifted. It's over. Key blast attack. Goku is spamming those all day. He's gone to level three. He barely lands the combo, but he landed it all the same. Are we going to see another throw here? Goku is in it. Goku is clutching up these last couple fights, but he couldn't clutch this one up and couldn't put it away. Piccolo can now beat Goku. He's putting back on the clothes, too. Piccolo can officially beat Goku. That's just the science of it. All right, now that we're getting late into the video, I'm going to stop just doing some random stuff because I want to see who Goku can actually beat. So we're going to do some some ones that I think people would want to see. Like, where is Saitama actually? I can't, I can't even see here. You know what? First up, before Saitama, we got to go up against Luffy. We already did each go and we'll probably do naruto as well i got i gotta see for myself what's luffy bringing to the table here where'd luffy go <laughs> bro came in hella late what did you do in that late all right here we go luffy versus goku a matchup we've all been waiting for it's time to see oh chase down luffy just running away though there we go goku's got him caught now got him in the corner but luffy why luffy and ichigo are both insane speed threats i'm not even seeing the combos luffy just putting out damage key blast cannon get off the ground goku wants to see you Oh, he's got Conqueror's Hockey. Damn, he's different, bro. Just walked up and hit him with the axe kick. Oh, what is he doing? He's got to be in gear set. He's in gear second, gear third. Oh, my God. He's just going into all the gears. He's at three bars. Oh, damn. Luffy putting up a hell of a fight now. Oh, Bazooka from above. He's too fast for Goku. Luffy might actually be a threat that could take him down. Oh, gear second again. That's rough. Goku's going to need a hell of a comeback if he's going to beat Luffy now. It's looking like it might be over. Luffy with an amazing combo. He's going to put it away with gear second probably. He's too fast for Goku. Oh, Goku with the key blast barrage. He's going to need a few more lucky hits though. And Luffy's not going to give it to him. Luffy can officially beat Goku. I don't know the science, but it checks out. But what about Naruto? Can Goku beat Naruto? Can Naruto beat Goku? We need to find that out. Oh, why are these guys just going fisticuffs? Shadow clone jutsu? Damn, Naruto put him in his, put him in some work right now. Goku with a combo of his own. Naruto's going to need some more shadow clones here. Damn, trio. Oh, the sexy jutsu. I don't know why sex appeal seems to be a big thing against Goku today. Reverse harem jutsu. Oh, let's go. I realize I called it sexy jutsu, and uh, you know what? I'm not going to take it back. He fighting. Into transmission. Goku uses it a lot, but we haven't seen that move put in a ton of work. Naruto, back to the shadow clones. He keeps going with the same combo just to send him into the wall. Air dashing. Naruto can air dash. Another reverse harem jutsu. Sex appeal is huge against Nunk Goku. If you want to be Goku, it's all in the sex appeal. He was going for the same reverse harem jutsu again. He was going for the same jutsu again. You thought Rasengan was a specialty? Nah, Naruto has one jutsu and his reverse harem. Bam. Now we have an actual match. He tried to do reverse harem jutsu again. <laughs> Somebody help Naruto. Paper bombs. <laughs> It doesn't look like Naruto's gonna get the win here. He needs a few more reverse harem jutsus, and Goku's not gonna give him the time. Actually, unreal. 
You hate to see it for Goku to end like that, but that's gonna be it for him. What about Yugi? Can, Go can Yugi beat Goku? This is why this video exists, to find out if Yugi could beat Goku. Whoa, look at his opening hand. Karibo, B Magda Warrior, Buster Blader, Time... Oh, he actually can summon all of the cards in his hand. He still has Karibo. He has access to Karibo. Oh, he redrew his hand. He shuffled again. He has Pot of Greed. Yugi needs to play Pot of Greed if he's going to stand a chance. He played Multiply. Do something, Yugi. Draw the out. Draw the out, Yugi. He's not drawing no out. Bro is barely playing any cards. Summon Skull. Hurry, Yugi. He has three bars. Could he possibly be trying to summon a god? He played Karibo against the Kamehameha. It seemed to work. He blocked it again with Karibo, but he's still taking chip damage. The Dark Magician duo! My god, he's using every card in his arsenal. Another Dark Magician combo, and he set a face-down card as well. What could that trap card be? It better be Magic Cylinder if Yugi's going to win this match. Goku might have just landed on the trap card. He didn't. Yugi can't get him to the trap card. Oh no, play Pot of Greed, Yugi. He didn't do it. Yugi almost summoned a god card, but he failed to draw the proper cards. He couldn't draw the out, and that is why Yugi cannot beat Goku. And now for the final match of the video, I wanted to do, and I, you know what, if this video gets enough likes, I'll come back and see who else can beat Goku. But right now, I need to go ahead and see if Saitama, one punch man himself, stands a chance against Goku. We've seen a lot of great fights this video, and I'm expecting this one to be one of the best. Why is his, what, this is the second competitor that just has their dick out. There we go. Saitama versus Goku. This is what I need to see. This this is what I needed to see right here. Here we go, the match of the century, let's go. Can Saitama beat Goku? Saitama just seems pissed, he's angry he's even here. Oh, Goku tried to beam attack, but Saitama doesn't even, he's bringing down a meteor. Oh wait, he's actually saving the world. And uh, unfortunately for him, Goku, oh my God. That was a lot of damage. So far, he hasn't even fought Goku. He's just saving the world. Goku is... Oh my god. Goku wants to see all the strength, though. Saitama hasn't actually landed a physical hit against Goku. Another beam? Another beam. Saitama's getting worked. Oh, now we're seeing some combos, though. Damn. Damn. Where'd he go? There he is. Jesus Christ. He's taking him to hell in a cell. Threw him back out of the ground. He's back in the dirt. Watch out, Goku. Damn. Ah! Goku's getting worked now. Saitama's fast. But is he fast enough? This is crazy, this is crazy. Saitama's pretty low. He needs to break out of this combo. He got hit again and Goku's gonna seal the deal against Saitama. What an amazing video. We've learned today that Goku gets beaten by Hancock and by Luffy. And that's it, One Piece is One Piece versus really doing well against Goku. But that's gonna be it for this video. If you like the video, wanna see Goku fight more people, let me know, cause I definitely wanna see more like Jojo's. We gotta go through a lot of the characters. Demon Slayer, we didn't get to do anything. Gojo himself. Yeah, we might be doing another one of these videos. But let me know down below in the comments who you think could beat Goku. Other than that, leave a like, subscribe to the channel, and I will see you in the next one.